Well, Mo finally came home this afternoon. He's in the backyard. It's going on. It's after 4.30. That's Gilly screaming in the background. We've got the collar off him so he can give himself a bit of a washy. He's had a collar on now for the best part of nearly two weeks. He's a bit on the wobbly side. Got to be careful. He's got stitches in the stomach from his laparoplopomy. You know, where they went in through the stomach. And those stitches will get taken out next Friday, next week. And the stitches in the hindquarters are dissolving stitches after the second procedure and they will, oddly enough, dissolve by themselves. Here comes little Jaffa. She's not a happy chappy. She cannot stand it. Each time he's come home, she's growled somewhat. She doesn't like the, the vet smells that he brings home. She's going to be a bit upset now because she's been sleeping on my desk the last two weeks. And now His Highness is back. He'll probably come back onto my desk. Mo, would you like to put your hind leg down? That's where he was operated on. And he's in pretty good spirits considering he's purring before. There's Jaffa coming around to check out what's going on. She's coming around behind. No, she's not. She's pretty jealous. But Mo hasn't had a chance to wash. And because he's got to be careful with his stitches, his collar's got to go on. And there he is. There's Moonface. He's trying, you can see he's trying desperately to wash himself. And now this is going to be awful for the next 10 days. Evelyn, that's almost coming off. It's not. The thing's holding it on. He can't walk. Jeff is growling a bit. Jeff, um. He's following you, Evelyn. And oh, no. He can't get it. <laughs> He's completely bewildered with that helmet on. No. Okay. Stop this. Get some more tomorrow.